Remember, we shouldn't allow our good deeds to be taken away and we shouldn't allow our fasting and good deeds to be wasted by using the tongue in a wrong way. Many people, when it comes to two o'clock in the afternoon, they're accustomed to having lunch. Now there's no lunch. What happens? The tempers begin to flare. They become short fuse. They become short wire, as they say in our language, right? And suddenly, out of nothing, they get angry. They vent and they think they did a good deed. Come 4 p.m., you need to manage your temper. Come 5 p.m., you need to manage it even more, especially when you're driving home and you know that there is a date. I'm talking of the date as in that to eat, subhanAllah. There is a date, subhanAllah, that you need to put in your mouth at a certain time and you know the traffic, you're caught with it. So now you start getting angry on the road. No, no, you're fasting. The Prophet Sallallahu says, even if someone swears you, say, I'm fasting. It's okay, I'm different, I'm fasting. And the fasting should help control us and our temper and our character. And that's why the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam says, Every year we hear this hadith, whoever has borne false witness and whoever has not quit the bad language and the falsehood and so on and so forth, especially during the month of Ramadan, Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala does not require the fasting from him. What did you waste your time fasting for? It's like you see someone swearing, cheating, lying, deceiving in Ramadan. The question being asked here is, why did you just waste your time fasting? 